Ascension, Idealism, and Not Today. Not today, guys. Not today. Idealism is pretty nice. Reaper Crest. Can we cook something with Reaper Crest? I think we can, guys. I think we can giga cook something. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I like that. Reaper Crest. I think I can cook something, man. Let's cook something with Reaper Crest. Witness full strength. I have a lot of this guy. You forgot to bow. Interesting. I don't have a Reaper yet. We might go Darius reroll. We might go Darius reroll, guys. Dare I say. Wait, I have a Reaper. <laughs> Classic. Classic, guys. Of course I have a Reaper, man. It gives me a Reaper Crest and a Reaper. How, how can I not have Reaper? I was looking for Kha'Zix. Classic, guys. Okay, so we go... We go Darius and Kha'Zix reroll. How, how bad does it sound to you? Not really, right? And then uh, Umbral connects into Yone, which is also a Reaper and Umbral. Like, how bad does this sound to you? It doesn't. And then Heavenly Duelist? Like, it really is coming along. It's coming along right about now. It really is. It is pretty cool, actually. Wow. Okay, let's go. Not too bad. We get Umbral, we get all of all kinds of stuff. Uh, what is the best build on, on Darius, guys? He is an AP unit, guys. So he deals 300 magic damage to adjacent enemies. He probably does a spin, right? Yeah, he spins, does a bunch of damage. And then for a couple seconds, his next attacks deal bonus magic damage. What about what about the Rabadon's Bloodthirster? Rabadon's Bloodthirster. Four um Umbral and four Reaper is good enough. Probably. Titans. Titans is uh it's okay, but eh. Ooh, Umbral. We'll take it, guys. <laughs> Wait, hold up. There's a funny freaking thing. There's a funny freaking message. I sent your 10 Spellweaver video to a friend who hasn't been playing long and said she likes Storyweaver on PvE. She replied this to me last night. Ugh. I just can't watch his videos because he just rubs me the wrong way. Lemao dot dot dot. She doesn't like the feet talk as much as we do. <laughs> Guys, I do create some polarizing content, don't I? There was one girl in the YouTube comments once. She said, I would definitely not trust. I like the way he, is, he explains things, but I would definitely not trust him with my drink. No oh boy. Now this lady. That just messaged her friend, right? The, the message I just wrote, uh, read on, on Twitch, right? That makes sense, bro. I am a degenerate. Like, I rub you the wrong way. Like, I would love to rub you the wrong I would love... Uh, anyway, guys. Um, yeah. Anyway, guys. Sorry. Uh, sorry, guys. But anyway, yeah, I'm, I'm just proving my point. I'm just pr proving my point, guys. But anyway, so, like, I definitely rub people the wrong way, right? It's, it's disgusting. Like, I keep talking about my Korean comics lately, right? With my with my Nunas, with my big bosom Nunas, you know? Like, I'm a degenerate, right? Obviously. But guys, <sighs> going a step further and saying you wouldn't trust me with your drink. Brother, man, I have not been in a setting where there is any drinks. I am... As anti-social as it gets. I'm a freaking nerd. I do I haven't had a single sip of alcohol in my entire life. Brother man, trust me, lady. I do not wanna talk to you if I see a sip of a sip of uh, if I see a drink in your hand. No offense. That rubbed me the wrong way, guys. 
But you guys are based because a lot of you defended me under that comment. That comment is right, like a year old. I don't even remember which video it was. But everyone was like, nice projection, bro. <laughs> Something like that. A base, guys. But yeah, that was, that, was, that was a little bit crazy. But yeah, no, no, no. Ugh. I just can't watch his videos. He just rubs me the wrong way. No, no, no. That is, that is very understandable. That is very understandable. Luckily, there is a lot of us degenerates. So there is a market for my type of content. Thank you, guys. I appreciate you. Based. Let's go, baby boy! It's a forced! Okay, so this is gonna be a cool team, though. Like, let's, let's get back to the game. This is gonna be genuinely a cool team. Like, I feel like he's doing well. We just need some lifesteal on him. Um, we have the Reaper Crest. We will play... Like, we can play these guys, right? And then we, we want to get this guy eventually, right? Because frick this stupid Kindred. Um, and then we have some Heavenly action. We can get some more Heavenly action. Like, it's really not that bad. I like it. We can get some more Umbral as well if we want. Four Umbral for some more execution. Again, for the people who don't know, the Reaper trait gives all the Reapers bonus crit chance. And they are able to crit on their abilities. So we don't need Jewel Gauntlet or something. Um, then at 4 Reaper, which we absolutely want to play because that is a crazy effect. Uh, Reapers bleed enemies for 50% bonus true damage over 3 seconds. So every instance of damage my Reapers deal, it will take 50% of that and apply it as a bleed over 3 seconds in true damage. It's crazy. It just it gives you 50% bonus damage. Absolutely crazy. So this is definitely... Like we need to play 4, four Reaper 100%. Four Reaper, 100%. And then I'm down to just three-star this Malfi. Like, I'm down to three-star Malfi as well, because it's gonna be a decent tank, and it's more heavenly stats, right? And then I'm actually down to just play uh, Shen for Behemoth on Ghostly. And I like this. This is a decent thing. This is We have a decent thing going on here. This is a decent freaking thing. I like this. I do think this might be a comp at some point. And then we just push levels to play more uh, juicers. It's really not bad. I could go Hodge. Very greedy though. No, no lifesteal. Very greedy. I'm not going to sell Maltite. Actually, I will though because I'm so far. I'm so close to... Like, I only need four Dariuses. I need seven Malphites and I need nine Kha'Zix. It seems like we will not three-star Kha'Zix. That's just what it seems like. We are on champion delivery, by the way. Guys, I'm down to go Hodge. Frick it. I can position him in a way where he's not gonna die immediately. I'm down to go Hodge. Frick it, man. Because it, it ties in well with the crit chance of Reaper. Edgar on Dota 2. Brother, I thought I would look at Twitch chat to see if someone has a question. And I see uh, someone is calling me an Edgar again, guys. You think you're funny? Do you think you're funny, guys? You just keep calling me an Edgar. Ah, really funny, guys. Really funny. Hilarious. Really cool, guys. I could also play this guy and then just level 8. Just don't even play Ghostly. Yeah, freak Ghostly. Oh, yeah, this is cool. This is better. And then I can just add um, a Loon. Like, look at this, guys. This is, this is... I like this. We like those. And then this could... Yeah, and this is level, level 8, right? Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. The duelists start combat with three stacks. At max stacks, they gain 10% Omnivam. Is this good? It gives him a lot of Omnivam. I think it's good. But then I want to go very deep into duelists, right? Now I just want to shift my focus of the team. We want to go very deep into duelists now. It also gives me a Darius. Why, why did I not buy the Tristana? Classic, guys. El Classico, guys. Almost three star. Okay, now we want to shift our whole comp. Now we want to go very deep into Duelist because we have an augment that benefits Duelists. 
So we're actually not gonna go deep at all into this trash. Uh, into Umbral. Um, still want him for Reaper. Okay, so we're not gonna go deep into Umbral. We'll just go full Duelist then. We'll just stack Duelists up. We're not even gonna play Behemoth then. Just stack Duelists. Oh, sure. So we'll have uh, Volley Bear as our tank, I assume. Offers you a temporary item which lasts three rounds. I'll go for a Warmox. Thank you very much, Kindred. Two Star Loon is Two Star Loon, though. But honestly, do we give a frick? It's so expensive, right? I alone decide my fate. Three Star Yasuo is Three Star Yasuo. And it's a temporary item, I'll just give it to her. She's gonna get Omnivam. <sighs> I don't think I'm supposed to 3-star her. Am I supposed to go 3-star Yasuo as well? No, right? It's so stupid, right? There's no way. But honestly, 3-star Yasuo is kinda good. I have a Titans. Not really though, like I need to push levels to play for Umbral, uh, for, for Duelist, uh, for, for Reaper, excuse me. I don't think I 3-star, I, I think I just push levels now, right? We push levels. We only have four Yasuos, exactly. Yeah, we, we push levels. For sure. For sure we push levels. There is a juicy guy. Can you spot it? I'm sure you can spot it. I'm sure you can spot that mother trucker. I kind of want to go three star, um, three star Kiana though, as well. Nice, we got it, bro. We got it. That's huge. We get four Reaper. We get four Reaper right here. We level. We level, we get four Reaper, two Duelists still, it's fine. And then we can probably just... Wow. Wow. Okay. I'm just gonna go ahead and sell the Kindred. She's a piece of garbage. I'm gonna sell these idiots. That is good. It's looking good, man. And now the question is, do we want to itemize the Duelists or the Reapers? I think the Reapers, right? Let's keep it a buck, guys. We're itemizing the Reapers. I have an Edge of Night. Like, it's a freaking Cane too. It's a Reaper, man. Like, four Reaper is so much better than Duelist. Even if we have this little Augment, it doesn't even matter, bro. Like, it doesn't even matter, bro. It's just good for the for the guy to get more Omnivan. If we get another Reaper emblem, then we have a Duelist, Reaper, Kiana. That would be... That would be crazy. That would be crazy. That would be the best we can get here. That would be really insane. And then we just don't even play Kha'Zix. That would be weird, though. We want to play Kha'Zix. We don't even play... Uh, we don't even play Kane. then. Who cares, bro? I'll just roll on 6 for 3 Sarkiana. What's this? Offers you a boon if you save his hunger. We're not going to do this. Because he wants one of our shop slots. Lose a shop slot and get 3 component anvils. We cannot do that. We cannot do that. I'm really just pushing levels now and rolling for a 2-star cane, right? Later on. So honestly, I will do it. I will do it. I'm not gonna re-roll anything, so it's fine. I think it's fine, yeah? Um, I get an even shroud. Well, these items are kind of bad. I guess I'll go Ionic Spark. I do need Ionic Spark, right? Yeah, I got a sword. Thank you, man. I mean, I need Ionic Spark and I need even Shroud, right? Because my, my guy is magic damage right now, so... We're not gonna lose this, right? Surely? They're just in the corner. We can't attack. Okay. <sighs> I wanted the Giant Slayer for the cane. We did get one, so that's good. 
What's our last augment? I hope we get... There is a Reaper augment where if they get kills, they get more Omni Vamp, right? And more crit chance. That one's that one's very good. That one's really good. Okay, so I just want to go level 8, and I guess I'm just rolling for... I'm not rolling for 3-star Tristana, I'm just rolling for 2-star this guy. So what's our board now? What's our board now? We go Volvo Bear as our tank. Tristana. We just go level 9 to play 6 Duelists, right? And the Darius just gets Giga Empowered. Seems fine to me, I guess. I don't know. Seem like we're going level 9 and we're playing all these units just to empower our... Darius seems a little bit weird, right? Yeah, we are on champion delivery, so I get the champion delivered right there. Like a bus. Like a bussy, guys. What? Sorry? Our okay. alive. What? Sorry. Bro, this guy is so squishy, man. He's just gonna die, isn't he? Uh, are we supposed to play six duelist just because we have the duelist augment it is pretty good it is really good like three stacks at the start like after the cane i'm not gonna itemize yone i think yone is not that good of a champion so i'm gonna itemize cane and then i can itemize duelist right like cane is really good man Cane blue form bussy hitting diff. <sighs> Duelist crown, I go Duelist Yone. Honestly, the egg is good win condition, right? The egg is an actual good win condition, no cap. I'm not even I'm not even trolling. It's actually a good win condition. And then I just level now. Because I have six duelists, like a boss. I found it. Wait, did I? Wait, do I have six duelists? No, oh, but I have four duelists. That's pretty good too. Like what's wrong with four duelists? Nothing? And then I'm playing this guy for Ghostly. I'm playing this guy for Ghostly. I'll just kick Yasuo. I'll play uh, I'll play Volley Bear. I'll kick Yasuo. I'll play Volley Bear, right? I'm never playing this the girl. I kick Yasuo. I play Volley Bear, right? And Volley Bear is my tank, right? We're gonna play four duelists. Like we can't, we can't kick. And then we kick. Uh, we play Morgana for Ghostly. Which is gonna give us a slight damage increase. Gonna make the enemies take more damage. Because like I can't play six duelist. I would have to get rid of four Reaper. I can only play six duelist if I'm level nine. I can only play six duelist if I'm level nine. Yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah. Exactly. I can't go level nine yet, so this is fine. Like I have to roll here to hit a spike. Some call me evil. Shall I prove them right? <clears throat> I hope this is fine. I, I'm so scared about putting the Darius into the front line. I want him to be safe in that little pocket there. But if I put him in the pocket, no then the the, 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 the the cane has to walk all the way across the other side. And he cannot also be in the pocket. And that's really annoying. Diana level 9. I don't hate that. I like that idea. Because I really don't hate playing Ghostly. And it's gonna give us Omni Vamp with Sage. I don't, I don't hate that at all. <clears throat> Yone adds a bonus offensive component. Okay. We don't have heal reduction, right? We don't have heal reduction. So let's just grab Morgana, heal reduction, Morello. Morello here. 
Oh, nice. I get the cloak as well for tankiness. Whew. Okay, so we want Volley Bear instead of this trash Yasuo. That's huge. Wait, we do not have heal reduction, right? Or am I dumb? You know, I see the Twitch chat typing very fast. So I'm like, oh, maybe they're saying something good. And all they're saying... All they're saying... <laughs> Wait, let me give him my item. <laughs> I see the Twitch chat type fast, so I thought I'm doing something wrong, right? I'm like, oh, maybe I do have heal reduction, because I do make that mistake. And then all they're saying is... Edgar with WhatsApp fade. And they put a cat emoji. I do not understand you guys, man. I am 50 years old. I don't... I'm not a zoomer, guys. Like, what the frick are you talking about, man? Edgar with WhatsApp reroll cat emoji. I don't get it, guys, man. Like, I don't get it. I'm not a freaking Edgar, man. Did they buff Ash? No, but she has a Radiant Death Blade. That's what happens. <laughs> this guy's full 100 streaking. It's fine, though. He's not our enemy. Uh, this guy, sometimes you just giga high roll. You play well, you giga high roll. You're just winning the game. Like, you're just full 100 streak, like a boss. He's not our enemy. Our enemies are the others. If we can beat them, we're doing super well. I'm gonna pop the egg. So I'm, I'm, I wanna play aggressive while I'm trying to pop the egg, right? So I'm rolling down here to freaking pop the egg. And as soon as we pop the egg, we're back. Okay, low key. I think I do this. Because a lot of the enemies are on the right hand side. Uh, on the left hand side. So we can actually do this. Look, the Teemo is going to attack this first. Yeah, this is good. This is good. This is a very good positioning. Should be good. And my, look, my cane. Look, my cane is just tearing them apart. It's just, it's just getting their bussies, man. Get their bussies, bro. Yeah, nice. I mean, this guy is dead. Nice. We're about to pop egg. Let's go. Yeah, egg was good, I think. Because it gives a uh, win condition. Egg is a win condition. Also, this guy is still pretty tanky, right? He does get pretty tanky. He heals, but he doesn't heal for that much. Is he still tanky? He's, he's tankier than Yasuo, right? He's freaking tankier than Yasuo, right, surely? Lil bro off the perk. No, man, I'm not off the perk. I mean, yes, I was never on the perk. Guys, like, stop it, man, please. <laughs> stop bullying me, man. Okay, hold up. So what do I not need anymore? I'm not gonna 3-star Yone, right? It's too bad. What you make me do? I wanna make 30. I wanna make 30 for sure. I don't give a freak. Legends are told I got a... I got a Irelia, of course. Uh, do we ditch anything for Irelia? I don't think so. I think Irelia is pretty fake. I really doesn't actually fit into Duelist. No I'll explain why, don't worry. Let me just roll here to hit my stuff. Huge spike. Huge spike. So I really doesn't actually fit into Duelist, guys. Because the way she scales is her attack speed scaling just gives her attack damage, but the conversion ratio is not that good. So she she's not actually that good. If you play vertical duelist, how you want to play Irelia is you want infinite frontline, and then you want the two star Irelia with perfect items, and two duelist is what like it's fine. Just two duelist is fine, and then you win. You know, like that's when she's good. She needs a lot of time. To, uh, she's gonna kill the entire board eventually, but she needs a lot of time. So you want infinite frontline. And this is not infinite frontline, guys. This this Irelia is actually not good here. It's genuinely not good. Now, Reaper Emblem Irelia would be pretty dank. If I want to win this game, I probably have to sell the guy eventually. 
Alright guys, but honestly, like it looks like I'm struggling, right? But I'm not actually struggling, right? So don't we just sell this egg? It sells for zero gold. But I feel like if we keep the egg, we just win the game so easily, it's not even fun anymore. Like, I, I don't think I'm struggling. It looks like I'm struggling, but like, bro, with the egg, the game becomes too easy. Like, we're almost guaranteed top two. It's boring. I'm gonna sell it, man. It's just zero gold, but who cares? Frick it. I'm just gonna sell it. Like, it's just not fun, man. It's not even fun to watch for the Twitch chat either. Frick it, I'll sell it. Look what you made me do! You guys are dumb as frick, man. You, you thought you can sell the egg? For what? What would be the point of that? Are you stupid, Twitch chat? Like, that just wouldn't be fun. What's the point of that? Man, this Twitch chat is dumb as frick, guys. I'll keep it a stack. Okay, and now we can actually win the game because we go three star Lee Sin, right? Three star Lee Sin as our win condition. As our ultimate win condition. And Zonyas on the guy is good, and he gets a little bit of Omnivamp from this. Combined with Zonyas, that should be enough. 10% Omnivamp with the Zonyas should be enough. Should legit be enough. Because the Zonyas is so insane, right? We're gonna fill the carousel with four cost champions. There's a oh my goodness, please. I'm last pick though, I don't know if I can get this. I was gonna say, uh, that would be the perfect thing. Oh my god, I got it. Now we get three Heavenly as well, which is gonna give us some Omnivamp with the Heavenly Emblem. That's gonna be insane. It's Again, it's just gonna be like 4% Omnivamp, but bro, it, it's, it's Omnivamp, you know? It's good enough. It's good enough, bro. I'm just gonna give it to him because I'm never gonna itemize him. Bro, it's like 4% Omnivamp or something. Because he's 2 star. It still says 3, but it gets rounded up to 4. And then we'll never play her. We'll legit just play Sage to get uh, more Omnivamp. And then we're good to go, man. This is actually a really strong team now. This is genuinely a really strong team. That was a huge egg because the egg is gonna give me a 3 star Lee Sin potentially as well. But I want to roll on 9. I want to go level 9 with Diana. And then just roll down for 3-star Lee Sin. And call it a day. Yep. 3-star Lee Sin after uh, Elder Dragon. We sack until uh, stage 6-2. Six 6-2 two. Six two, we roll down. We level and roll down. Because we still have enough health, right? To get the maximum amount of money. We have two duplicators. Should be possible to get. <laughs> yes, a boy! <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. Apologize. Sorry, guys. What is he doing, bro? It's two-star guy. Bro, you want to itemize a Mumu instead of this? Bro, you gotta be dumb as frick. Also, he has six ashes. He's trying to hit a Mumu three or what? He has six ashes, but I don't even give. I don't care. Like if he hits uh, Ash three, I'm happy. It's a good YouTube. Like it's good YouTube content. Like what's more fun, getting a first with Lee Sin three, or getting a second and seeing Lee Sin three fight Ash three, and who knows who wins, right? I think that's all good. Seven ashes, yeah. Like I, I think that's fun. But as soon as I see him buy one Lee Sin, he's going down, bro. I'm gonna buy every single Ash. As soon as I see him buy one, just one, it's over. I'm not gonna print units with Wei. I'm gonna run out of time. Needs four turns to print one Lee Sin. Actually, I could get four turns though. Eh, eh. I would have to make my, t my board weaker as well. It's too risky. <clears throat> it's too risky. We wanna just play Sage and we're good. Guy has two star Lee Sin. This guy, yeah, yeah, he's gonna die soon, though. We're waiting for him to die. But then we'll roll down. Let's go. We want the Lee Sin unit here. Uh, Lee Sin item, I mean. Uh, I think it's Infinity Edge, right? It's actually pretty insane on Lee Sin. 
Just to level. I mean, I'm for sure gonna level here. I'm not gonna roll yet, right? I can also sell board and try to hit 3 star uh, Aurelia. Probably not gonna happen though. I mean, is this guy gonna lose? I don't know, probably not, right? I don't think I win against him. The Soraka is on the left side. We can win. He has a, a useless move here. But he has a 2 star Wukong, which is very, very powerful. My Lee Sin is kicking them, or not kicking the units, but like doing a lot of damage with his kicks. Holy frick, that damage is crazy, yo. Lifesteal, lifesteal. Life steal? Pain, 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 pain. Freak that guy, man. We need to, we need him to die. Fast, 15 health. Is he gonna die? Like I can't roll yet, right? Bro, I hope I'm fighting Ghost and he's fighting real. No, I can't be fighting real again, right? I just fought the Ash player. I just fought him. He's gonna lose to Ash, I think. Bro, like. I don't really have an avenue to get any other 3-star. I mean, I could get, like, Kane 3-star as well, right? Kane or Morgana 3-star. Morgana is being used as well, but Kane isn't being used. Kane 3-star would actually be insane, yeah. Why you always miss one unit in shop because of the because of the encounter with Cho'Gath? I lose a shop slot, but I get three component anvils. I took that deal. Because it was pretty good. At that time, I had to. Okay, I'm against Ghost, so hopefully this guy just dies. I think he's dead. Huge, huge guys. We roll down now. Oh, I really don't need. Okay. The power of a dragon. I could go for Morgana as well, right? It's so hard without the additional ben uh, shop slots. I think I should sell Morgana. Morgana isn't even gonna win. Who gets this lone bow? <clears throat> I don't think we win these fights against this guy. This guy's really strong with the Radiant Deathblade. I need a 3 star. I mean, I'm playing a 1 cost uh, carry, right? Like, my one cost carry has all of my trades, so... Like, he's the most invested in. So, of course, we're not gonna... We're not gonna beat this guy. We still have two lives. We cannot get one shot at 24. He gets another porcelain emblem. <laughs> right in front of his face, by the way. And I'm not gonna deny it. Whatever, bro. Enjoy. He doesn't even want it. I mean, I'm gonna get the QSS, right? That's what I wanted anyway. No can hold Is he holding any of my units? Or no? Please stop giving me legendaries, man. Still have one more fight. Is he holding any Lee Sins? No, he's not. He's one of Ash, by the way. He's one of Ash. He's one of Ash. I'm one of Lee Sin. I only have one shop slot, though. Can get one shot. <coughs> he's one of Ash. Hit Ash 3? You're kidding me.
I mean, it wasn't obvious though that I would lose. Okay, but okay, can I just say something? Can I just say something? He hits Ash 3 without duplicators. I have two duplicators and I have to sell my board to hit to hit Lee Sin 3. And yeah, Lee Sin is like Lee Sin compared to Ash, right? It's not it's not even close, right? Like usually the ranged units always win in the four cost matchup, right? But I just wanna I just wanna point out the bad luck required for this to happen. I just wanna point that out real quick. Just wanna point that out. If I had some more time, I could move like the Zonyas to him, uh, Edge of Night, like, you know, or the Edge of Night, whatever, right? But he has good items. He has full crit, has lifesteal. I don't know, man. I don't know, guys. He just got one shot by Ash. I mean, yeah, again, she's a ranger, but uh, kind of crazy how it's so hard to hit these three star four costs, man. We will take it though, guys. The golden egg, always a fun one. Remember, that was the guy that was full win streaking, right? That guy was completely smurfing on everyone. Second place is good here. Subscribe, ring Haitian bell if you enjoy these TFT videos. Also, make sure to leave an algorithmic comment and an algorithmic like down below to support this video in the algorithm so I can get some more views. I'll see you next time. Peace.